Comrade Chairman, Comrade Member of Parliament in waiting, Comrade Leader of the People's National Party, Comrade Warriors and Foot Soldiers of the People's National Party, the word is love. Comrades, all day we have been on the road and we traveled from Clanmel and we come to Aleppo, come down to Richmond, come to Zion Hill and down to Cain Hill. And I tell you, when I reach Queen Hill Square and I look to the east and I look to the west, I look to the north and I look to the south and PNP River come down bank to bank, comrades. And comrades, when I come upon this stage, I look on my phone and I get a little text message and somebody tell me I don't know if it's fake news them say the man who are the counselor when him see the crowd down here he may not be down on a tabby hospital comrades sure that we take home Shane Alexis and I am here to support Shane because I have to tell you I hear some of them a question Shane Alexis Bonifide as a Jamaican and some of them from them they are Jamaica them never make the amount of contribution where Shane and him family make to the advancement of Jamaica Me is a blind man. And in 1991, when I went to Kingston, she and Alexis' mother was an ophthalmologist working at the Jamaica Society for the Blind, providing voluntary service to blind and visually impaired people in Jamaica. And she has been doing that for over 30 odd years. You talk about service and commitment to Jamaica. And comrade Shane Alexis himself has been following in that vein because she has been providing voluntary service to Jamaicans right across the length and breadth of Jamaica. And I say that the people of Southeast St. Mary need a man who is committed, need a man who is dedicated, need a man who love people, need a man who have passion for the people. And we say, Shane for Southeast St. Mary. And let me tell you something, comrades. Because I am a St. Marian, I know what is good for my people. And I want to tell you that every time you see advancement and development in this parish, it is because of the People's National Party. Sugar 
factory was the bedrock, the economic bedrock for this constituency. And in the 1980s, it was the labor rights that locked down that cane factory and put thousands of St. Mary people out of work and them take the land and give it away to them friend and company. And we must send a signal to them on Monday that in Southeast St. Mary, a PNP country. God bless you, comrade. One love, one heart, as we march forward to the victory line with she and Alexis. God bless your comrades.